Hello, friends. I'm glad to be with you in prayer today. Today, as we pray, I'm going to offer a prayer about false prophets. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, as we gather in prayer this morning, we pray about false prophets. We realize that they may be viewed as our enemies, but we know that you have said, you have heard that it was said, you shall love your neighbor and hate your enemy. But I say to you, love your enemies and pray for those who persecute you, so that you may be children of your Father in heaven, for he makes the sun rise on the evil and on the good, and sends rain on the righteous and on the unrighteous. We know that the false prophets in our lives may be our enemies, but we pray for each of us to remember your admonition that we love our neighbors as ourselves. Amen. Friends, our reading for today is from the book of Matthew, from the seventh chapter, verses 13 through 21. Enter through the narrow gate, for the gate is wide and the road is easy that leads to destruction, and there are many who take it. For the gate is narrow and the road is hard that leads to life, and there are few who find it. Beware of false prophets who come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly are ravenous wolves. You will know them by their fruits. Are grapes gathered from thorns or figs from thistles? In the same way, every good tree bears good fruit, but the bad tree bears bad fruit. A good tree cannot bear bad fruit, nor can a bad tree bear good fruit. Every tree that does not bear good fruit is cut down and thrown into the fire. Thus you will know them by their fruits. Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but only the one who does the will of my Father in heaven. Friends, this is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Have a blessed day and love your neighbor as yourself.